Hey, what's up everybody? Here's another water comparison video. Tonight we're comparing these two Sadoff waters. First up is Sadoff Dillweed water. Next up is Sadoff Pussy Willow water. And these both say they're waters on the bottle. But if you go on Sadoff's website, these are listed under the essences and extracts section. Like they're not listed as a beverage on their website. I think these are just, they're meant to be flavors which you add to water and sugar. They actually list both of these as having 90 servings per bottle. So I think you're supposed to just drink a tiny amount of it and mix it with other drinks. But it says water, so I'm going to review it as if it's a water. Um, these are from an international store called Sultan Bay. These were each $3.99. I've reviewed rose waters in the past, and it's like, it's kind of good the first sip, but it's super strong tasting. So by the end of the bottle, I felt kind of sick. But uh, let's just open these up and get started. Sadoff has other flavors also. They have a, an orange flavor and a mint, and they have a rose water flavor. And these are, like, it's supposed to be popular in the Middle East, I think. And these are made in Iran. Yeah, <laughs> it's, got, it's got a really strong smell to it. It's, yeah, it's, I'm not even really sure what a pussy willow is. It's some kind of a flower, but it's it's got a strong smell. The website also says that dillweed has a very distinctive flavor and is used heavily in Middle Eastern cuisine. Again, very strong, very sharp smell. It's It smells like I'm out in a field right now, surrounded by just weeds and flowers and stuff. It smells like I just opened, you know, opened a window next to a field, because it's like a really strong smell. Okay, so we got pussy versus weed. Let's start with the pussy water. All right, that's not that's not as strong of a taste as I was expecting. Like I was expecting, I might have I might have like thrown up after my first sip, but it's not that strong. It's not that's not that terrible. Um, I kind of have a weak stomach. I, I I've thrown up in several water review videos from some just some disgusting waters. These both have zero calories, zero carbs, zero sugar, zero sodium, zero everything, and the only ingredients they list is. Pussy willow water and uh, dill, dillweed water. Let's try the dillweed. Yeah, it's it's actually more mild than I would have guessed. When it says ninety servings per bottle, I was expecting a super strong, super strong taste, but it's it's a, it's actually drinkable. I think. They're really not very clear on the bottle, like, that it's supposed to be mixed with other stuff. I, I didn't even realize that reading the bottle until I went to their website, that it's supposed to be mixed with other waters. It says it's 100% natural, but it doesn't say anything about mixing it or using it for cooking or anything else like that. Let's do the pH test. All right, you guys decide for yourself which color pH level you think they are. That's pussy on the left and weed on the right. They look pretty similar, but you guys decide which number you think they match up with. Yeah, it's actually not that bad. It's a lot more mild than I would have uh, guessed. Like, a lot more mild pussy flavor to it. This video is probably going to get demonetized just because YouTube's algorithm is going to hear me saying pussy and weed so much. There's a video on YouTube of Anderson Cooper doing some story about pussy willows. And he just cracks up for like a minute and a half. And the girl's striking back with a tap from a pussy willow branch. <laughs> I'm not going to let you do this one. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> and it's 
kind of cringy, actually, because he's like a newscaster on, uh, you know, national television. <laughs> oh, come on. He's just cracking up because of uh, the word pussy willow, basically. <laughs> I mean, these are different. It's a uh, very unique flavor. I wonder how they make this. I would, I'd be interested in seeing a tour of this factory. Do they just have a big bucket of water and just put a bunch of, like, weed and, and pussy willows in the bucket? Or how do they make this? Okay, I'm going to say that the winner is the uh, the pussy willow water. Um, it's, it's kind of just more of a mild taste to it. Um, apparently, I prefer pussy over weed. Yeah, the word pussy, I don't really like it. It's, it's so vulgar. And, you know, after Trump said grab him by the pussy, it kind of became, like, acceptable by society. And, um, I don't, I don't know. I don't really like it. I grew up just not using that term and, uh, just really vulgar. But the winner is the pussy willow water. So congratulations. The pussy water's moving on to the next round.